Hello. Hi, Papaya. Hello, my love. Hello. Um, check. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Hello, guitar. Yes. <laughs> um, hi. Hope you're all well. How's your day been? I'm trying to remember what day it is. It's Wednesday. Or how's your day going? If it just started. It's been hot. Yeah, I'm glad that it's uh, cooled down for now here. But yeah, you're in an actual oven. You went to the gym? Cool, cool. I would never. I respect it. I was, uh, as usual, um, doing all of the things at the same time and forgetting about time and forgetting to get, make coffee for myself and... Um, and then all of a sudden it was almost time for stream as I planned it and I had nothing ready and oh my god. <sighs> Feels like, for, well, basically 43. Oh, that's disgusting. That is disgusting. I also went to the gym. Now I'm stuffing myself with food. Yeah. That's... That's the way to go. And I did absolutely nothing today, okay? <laughs> That's lovely. I, I would like to do absolutely nothing, but I really suck at it. I just do all of the things all of the time. Or at least I try. That's, that's kind of my thing. I try to do all of the things all of the time. I mostly also try to do all of the things at the same time, even though... I really shouldn't because I suck at it. People are always like, oh, multitasking and all that jazz, but I, I can't. I can't. Anything and everything all of the time. Yes. I don't do multitasking well, but I do it anyway. Because my brain is all over the place. And I end up just running back and forth and going, Oh, you know what else I need to do? Oh, you know what I should be doing? Oh, oh yeah, remember what I was actually doing an hour ago? Let's actually finish that. But also, so, you know, it's a sign. Welcome to the internet. Yeah, basically my brain is the internet then, huh? It's a mess. Multitasking is actually not a thing. It's split tasking where your brain has to uh, swap between things. Yeah. Yep. I mean, except for uh, stuff like uh, breathing and things, which, fun fact, I uh, completely forget to do sometimes. I sometimes am so focused on something that I forget to breathe, and I also forget to swallow. And then the first... Uh, the first function that kicks in is the breathing part, which is really um, funny when you haven't swallowed in a while either, and then all of a sudden your body is like, shit, you're about to die, and then you start breathing because it's a reflex, and then you choke on your own spit. <laughs> it happens to me all of the time. Uh, welcome to the internet by Bo Burnham. It's a song. Okay, okay. I probably know it, to be honest. It, it rings a slight bell somewhere. I watched a video on it and did an exercise. It's really interesting how brains actually try to multitask by split tasking. It's, it's task tasking. Yes, I said it. I said it correctly the first time. <sighs> Why do dogs sit on feet? 
Giraffe does it too. Giraffe's not a dog, but he may as well be. Even humans forget how to human. Yeah, I'm supposed to be a human, huh? Oh, Burnham is pretty good. It Seriously, it rings a bell? But I don't know. Foot is warm, but like... They do it when it's hot. They have to like... <laughs> Dog is warmer. <laughs> they have to always like... Kind of just push against you or like sit on your foot or something. And Raf does the same thing. Again, Raf's not a dog. He's a Norwegian forest cat. But, uh, okay, see you soon. But, uh, yeah, he does it all the time too. But yeah, he's, he's pretty much been raised by a, um, big, a big dog, a big, um, Belgian melon. Me me mel no Wait, I just literally forgot how to say that word. Oh well. It's it's a shepherdy the, the, the kind of uh, dog, you know. I, I suck at I suck at words today. My mom's dog will be panting and dying in heat and still want to be on her lap, right? <laughs> yes, that's what I was looking for, and for some reason. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say, Malinois. Ma Malinois. <laughs> but, um. My mouth didn't want to do what my brain did, and then I just didn't. <laughs> I've been saying this word for a very long time, but unfortunately, um, you know, life happens. Seriously, it's been really bad lately. I've I've not been able to English, but also not been able to Dutch, and sometimes uh, those two gets mi get mixed up, and it's just one big giant ball of weirdness. And I just stop. Sometimes you just gotta stop talking for a while, which is hard when you have ADHD and you're me. Did we steal your Dutch? Yes. I was already speaking English most of the time anyway for years and then um, but at least it, it it was still a big part of um, <laughs> um, ik spreek not English yep that's that's Dunglish right there um Wait, what was I saying again? Oh my god, why am I like this? <laughs> I speak not Dutch. <laughs> oh my god. Um, wait, I was talking English all the time, I said. What, 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 where was I going with that? Hello? Oh, right. It was at least it was a big part of my uh, work still. So I had to uh, constantly. Um, uh, I had to constantly be speaking Dutch for my work. Um, and then that part became less and less. Also, I lost a bunch of Dutch friends. You know, that happens. And then uh, Viperius happened. And now I just really don't know how to speak Dutch anymore. Sorry, I was checking things. And now I'm trying to check my brain. It's not working. I need a subject to talk about. Can somebody give me a subject to talk about? Because seriously? Dog is not having a very good time tonight. Why? Where's your head at? Where's your head at? Why is dog not having a... It's old. Oh. It's old? Not cold? Old and cold? Very old. 
Uh, right. So, uh, this more okay. It wasn't morning for me. It was morning for Viperius. But <sighs> technically, I hadn't been awake for a very long time yet at that point. So, like, early in the day. I, I guess I'm just going to say early in the day. We were on VC, which we always are. Um, and, um, somehow it, it wasn't like, normally it's like a chill conversation and we're just quiet for a long, for, for longer periods of time in between because, you know, we're, uh, we're just chilling and he's still waking up because he'll still be like, in bed or he just got up or whatever and I'll just kind of be chilling because I've already had like I've already done some chores and stuff and I'm just trying to relax and it's like you know one of those easygoing convos where not a lot is said but uh, today was different we started chill and then all of a sudden we had like a really serious in-depth convo about like weapons and guns and cops and the differences between America and the Netherlands and like Jesus Christ I don't know what happened but it was a lot and um and then we had to end call because you know we had to do like actual real life stuff And then after that, we were all, uh, we were both just kind of dead and quiet. <laughs> so I've already had like all of my. What is happening, Jack? Wait. Very old. If dog were a human, at least ten years older than Mem. Okay, that's very old. The cheese. Domino's pizza probably? What are, what, what, where did the Domino's pizza and the cheese come from? <laughs> what? Huh? <laughs> Differences between not America and America? Oh god damn it. No, yeah, okay. Yes, right. Yes, I know, I know. So dramatic. I, I mean, I would actually, I am curious to know what the difference is between a, a Domino's pizza here and Domino's pizza there, because I feel like our Domino's is better than yours. In a sense that, you know what I'm saying? Like, uh, in a sense that regulations make it so that there's more fresh stuff going on than I feel like I've heard you talk about. And I'm not talking about, like, the place you're working at, but where you used to work. Because you used to work for Domino's, right? Or am I wrong? Did you work for... God damn it, my brain. You, or did you know someone who's... My brain. My brain. You were talking about Domino's at one point. Yeah, you work for Pizza Hut. Yeah, right. Pizza Hut is shit here too. I feel like we talked about Domino's at some point. Right. That's, that's it. That's what I mean. Pizza Hut here, I feel like, is um, strictly slices. I feel like when, if you find a Pizza Hut here, it's mostly, it's either at a festival or it's in a, in a, in a, in a train station or something. 
and it's like a tiny place and they only sell slices or or at least it's their main thing because pizza places in the Netherlands usually don't sell slices buying pizza by the slice is weird my roommate regularly gets pizza hut okay i think it's weird too but yeah yeah i always want pizza unless there's a cafeteria it's just not a thing here. You just eat an entire pizza, but that's because pizzas here are a much smaller than um, than in America. I am a huge fan of pizza. That's because like it's so versatile. You can do literally anything. I do like to make my own pizza though. Okay. Let me clarify, I don't like to make my own pizza. Because I don't like to cook. But I do like to eat my own pizza. So, you know, therefore I kind of have to make it. Pasta better? Pasta is very versatile too. You hate a pizza with a burning pa- But like... <sighs> A homemade pizza does taste way better than anything bought. Yeah. But it very much depends. Like, there's so many... Like, it matters so much where you get it. And then, like, who makes it. And, like, what's on it. Because if only I look at the, like, supermarket bought pizzas over here. Why are we talking about food? Anyway, I blame Jack. Um... <laughs> If only we're talking about supermarket bought pizzas. There's such a huge difference. They can be absolutely disgusting or actually pretty good. But also, uh, when I eat supermarket bought pizza, I always put a bunch of other shit on it. Like, I never just make a supermarket bought pizza. I always just throw a bunch of extra stuff on it. Extra cheese, olives, more garlic, uh, peppers, mushrooms, I don't fucking, uh, more onion, always. So like, ow, I'm sorry if you heard that, I just kicked something under my desk. That's what I normally did, more cheese and hotter peppers. My parents had a tiny portable wood fire oven. Ooh, nice. That's lovely, yeah. But I just like, I don't know. You hit yourself on the head with a book? Okay, I have to ask. How? I've walked into at least four doors. I'm starting to think that your eyes maybe need help because you know what sometimes you think you're just clumsy but then turns out you actually have an issue with your eyes or whatever I'm I am speaking from experience right I am not judging you I'm just saying that I just thought I was clumsy all the time then I figured out that actually my eyes have not been working together properly for literally my entire life and I didn't know any better so I was trying to read the book. My sister didn't want me to read the book. Okay, in that case, that's not clumsiness. That's just being bullied. I'm sorry. Oh, you have dyspraxia? Okay. Okay. <laughs> My coordination is abysmal. Oh, jeez, I'm so sorry. That's trash. The book was nowhere near my sister. Wait, what? I'm so confused. <laughs> oh, I love 
love that emote so much. But yeah, pizza. Oh, peaches! Also good. You bunked yourself? Oh my god, dude. <sighs> Relax. I hope you haven't had too much fun without me. Well, we were talking about pizza. Uh, and how... Um, and how uh, it really matters what's on your pizza and where you get it. And also that I can never just eat supermarket pizza without putting extra stuff on it myself. Peach pizza? Oh my god. Millions of peaches, peaches for me. Millions of peaches, peaches for free. I like peaches. I saw kiwi on pizza the other day. Ah, I can't eat kiwi anymore. I used to eat so much kiwi. And I always, I always was like, oh, it makes me feel funny. Like I get a weird, a tingly feeling in, in my mouth. And also I start sweating a little bit. I just, for some reason, assumed that everybody had that. And that was just normal. <laughs> yeah, I'm allergic. <laughs> the peach pizza. Oh my God. Can we just call it peach -sha? The pizza would be made entirely out of peach, even the, the sace. Peach dough with peach sace? Pe no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh, no. No. No, God! No, God, please, no, 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 <gasps> no. <gasps> well, you say picha. It sounds exactly like one of Czech's swear words. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> Yay, swear words. Why is this so bad? What, pe picha? It's, uh, come on now. I can see when it's like... Okay, but now I'm just making it into a dessert that doesn't have anything to do. Oh, now I'm just thinking of pe peaches. Now I can't see say peaches anymore without thinking that is peacha. Vulgar world for female genitals? Well, that's why we love peaches so much. What's, <laughs> what's wrong with my dessert idea? Um, I don't want them all to the the same. <laughs> I'm sorry, Papaya. <laughs> um, right. Now I'm just thinking, like having having a like a giant peach, like chop it in half, <laughs> or like no, wait. Oh my God, I'm starting to just—it's too much. Because we were also talking about kiwis, or well, Jack was, and then I started talking about kiwis, and then I just stopped because everybody's being weird, and, you know, that's just how it goes around here. How am I supposed to enjoy eating the peaches now? Because, I mean, <sighs> it's nice, juicy uh, peacha, right? I mean, don't bring your, don't bring your pizza into my stream, because you know it's gonna. <laughs> Ignore this chat when eating. Lesson learned. I mean, I kind of made it worse here, but uh, yeah, that's what I'm here for. <laughs> here, you can't even lurk uh, without with like 
while muting me it's it's stream elements is telling you not to mute me so you have to listen to me say picha all the time but um yeah okay so it can also be like slices but then you have to like perfectly uh like spread them out so they're like slightly on top of each other still you know how you would make like a pie or something so you have like a whole plate full of like yeah spread out the the peach right yeah 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 so you have a whole like plate like a just make a circle with the things and then and then you put like <laughs> yes exactly that's what i was going that was perfect that was perfect time for that command you put sace but like you put like cream on it right and then <laughs> and then you can add like other things that you like and you're not allergic for so in my case not kiwi you can add like uh strawberries or um cherries you know when we're talking about uh pizza we can also talk about you know popping that cherry you shouldn't need to add anything to good peaches. No, but we were trying to make a pizza. Uh, yeah. <laughs> and that's what happened in my brain when Jack was talking about peach pizza, which is much harder to say than pizza. So I'm just going to keep saying it. Um, and they can add all those things. Like, uh, you know. I will never say anything here. Yes, you will. You like it. You enjoy it. Oh, you're about to get a break, though. Because the ads are about to start. So then you can listen to ads instead of listening to me. Isn't that great? I'm about to ruin peaches. You can't ruin peaches. Peaches are great. Because uh, peaches come from a can. They were put there by a man in a factory down. <laughs> if I have my little way, I'd eat peaches every day. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> I haven't had peaches in years. Because it's, uh, yeah, it's a very seasonal thing over here. Anyone ever See that one film with Tim Th Timothy T Tim Timothy Sh what? <sighs> Help! You could consider the man a peaches packer. Oh my god! <sighs> James and the Giant Peach. I haven't. Oh, this is the song about my brain. Why aren't the ads starting yet? Hello? I have not read James and the Giant Peach, and I have also not seen a movie. Come on, ad. Start. Has the ad started yet? Because it's just yelling at me that it's about to start, but it's not. I think it's waiting for the song. I love this track. I am not removing it from my list because it is definitely my brain. Damn it. St okay, wait. I've read James and the Giant Peach. The ad is waiting for the bass to drop. Yeah, it definitely because now it says it's in, in progress. Now it says it's happening. I haven't. It's one of those books that was like on the list of things that I could possibly read and I still didn't. What is James and Giant Peach? Wait, what? Also, I love Call Me By Your Name. What? What am I missing? Oh, Peaches. Right. Peaches is great. That Peaches is also great. Speaking of vulgar papaya. I slip. Oh my god, I said speaking of vulgar and guess who's here? <laughs> <laughs> Call Me By Your Name is a movie and a book with Timothy T Oh, okay. But also Peaches is a singer and 
That was so weird. Uh, walk on. Yes, I am immediately just dead. <sighs> yes, James and the Giant Peach. Movie and book. I have not heard of... God damn it. Call me by your name. And Peaches is a singer who's very vulgar. Guess what? A Dutch person is on their way to me. Wanna hop in? What? Really? Oh my god. I'm jealous. <laughs> Go pick me up, Slip. Oh my god. We're starting a road trip? You actually are? Are you really? <gasps> really? I'm so jealous. Oh my god, have all the fun. That's great! Oh, that's awesome. Take pictures and stuff, please. Oh, then I also know... Then I also know who the Dutch person is. I just don't know them. But uh, there has been talking about said person. I feel like I'm missing all kinds of shit again. Also, let me actually do this. For the people who have not done this yet, or didn't realize, and are currently subbed. You can also have a walk-on, if you want. It's free! And whenever you're subbed, you can use it. So... Even if you can't afford a sub yourself and you and your sub ends, then next time you maybe get uh, get a um, gifted sub, uh, you'll be able to use it again. Okay, so this is to explain why I will be lurking after 10 p.m. EU time. I said EU for some reason. I have a I have a guest. And will not be sitting at the PC. <laughs> I'll miss you too. But also, I will probably not be streaming after 10 p.m. Just pretend I'm here, floating above you all in spectator mode. Oh my god. I'm... I feel like I'm missing everything. My brain does not want to engage. I'm so tired and I really should have had... Uh, should have had coffee, but I don't think coffee could have saved me, to be honest. Wait, what, what did I just... There has to be a clip on the hub? Wait, Jack? Huh? Oh, call me by your name is the thing I was referencing earlier. Oh. Yes. Actually want coffee too? The peach. Yes, the peach. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. I'm, I'm scared now. Maybe I don't know, want to know about the peach. Okay, have fun. Uh, have fun on the toilet. I mean, peaches are just a very normal thing to be vulgar about, you know? For, you know, just in case you didn't know, like, peaches have been ruined by so many people. Ruined? Like, depends on how you look at it, really. Viper gonna go look up the peach? <sighs> he has seen enough peaches in his day. <laughs> Oh my 
god, are you sorry yet that, um, like, that you encouraged me to go streaming? <laughs> <laughs> Enough. Like, no more peach for you. Nah, he can have peaches if he wants to. <laughs> or like... Aubergines, you know. <laughs> oh my god. I'm not taking away your peaches from you, or your, like, your, your fruits and vegetables from you, right? You, you can have fruits and vegetables however much you want, it's healthy. <laughs> I think I missed a few chapters, I don't want to know. Oh, okay. Good, good, good. <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> right. So when did we stop talking about pizza and went to peaches? It's all Papaya's fault. Like we just need a like we need a blame Papaya uh, emote. Dog is very cuddly. Oh, I want to cuddle the dog too. <laughs> Aubergine. <sighs> yes. That's what it's supposed to be called, okay? We can call it an eggplant. Like, it's supposed to be called an aubergine. Which is funny, because it's also the color of said uh, vegetable. Is it actually a vegetable? There's a question. Dog is named Dog, for the sake of the internet. Yeah, yeah, I get that. I, I got it. No, not sake. No. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, did you get back from the toilet already or are you just like on the toilet with the with with your thing? With, with your thing. Oh my god. With your phone. Your phone. Your phone, okay? Your phone. Okay, I'm holding. You're holding. Don't hold. Go to the fucking toilet, you weirdo. Jeez. Don't be a don't be a Dee Dee. Release your butt. Having to hold. Oh god damn it! Is the thing a taken? Taken. Uh, just taken. You know. Not occupied. No. Taken. Mountain goat. Yes. <laughs> that was me this morning. Like, I don't know why, but it kept going. Just running back and forth. Yes, taken. Mm hmm. Well, I'm. I'm sorry. That's horrible. It has a very particular set of skills. Oh my god. Dog says quack? Okay. Quacking. Oh no, I'm sorry. I hope I don't make y'all yawn. That would be awful. Dog is a bit broken. I mean, old dogs do quack sometimes. I'm so confused. Oh, Taken. Wait a second. How do you even... You're using the Dutch word? That yawn trick doesn't work on me? Oh my god. You are actually, because Taken... I mean, it's not really skills, I guess. It's, um... Oh my god, it's um... It can be chores, it can be... Tasks? Tasks. That's the word I'm looking for. Taken. Starring Liam Neeson. 
Dude. <sighs> assignment. Uh, oh, that can also be it. Yeah. It can also mean assignment. Oh my god. I hate it when words have six billion meanings. <sighs> I feel like I've... Mm, I have a very particular set of skills. I will find you. I feel like I've seen some or all of that movie, just didn't care. You're the one? Who's... Oh, yes, yes, he is the one whose hide you're taking. Uh, so Havoc, we were talking in, in Discord yesterday about um, how Jack desperately needs to be taller. Uh... And you would like to lose some of your height. So. If y'all can, like, arrange that. I did tell him that he'll also get some of your shoe size. Hey, big mama. So you can actually buy shoes in, like, normal stores without, like, having to be all complicated about it. I take a few inches, thank you. Okay. I mean, apparently we'd all uh, take a few inches here, but but that's not what we're talking about, Slip. Dog is now a cat? No sace. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Slip caught cheered X100. Yes, size. Size? No, Brian. It's either sace or sass, not size. <laughs> <laughs> Brian's not taking his job very seriously. You know that, right? I mean, I wouldn't either if I was Brian. Also, thank you for the bits. Oh my god. Slip courtier X10. <laughs> what about size toe? Inverted what? question mark. Okay, he can't even say though. Inverted question mark. <laughs> Size toe? <laughs> Viperius underscore FX Dex. Oh my god. <laughs> Size. Size. <laughs> Cheered. <laughs> yeah, but like also the uh the 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 mm, sound. It used to just be the same sound. And now it somehow drops at the end. It's so weird. And then it's Viperius underscore FX ch it. <laughs> Why ch it? <laughs> Wait, did, did you peep all right? Apparently not. Oh no, it's two um, things. Uh, it's two capital ca capital P's. It's 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 like this. It, oh, so close, so close. Brian's English is worse than mine. Brian's English is worse than anyone's English. And Brian's names are na yeah his his name pronunciations are the actual worst. Hi, dog. I want to cuddle the dog, too. Oh, Jesus. Slip courtier X10 <laughs> underscore underscore question mark nice underscore. Oh, my underscore, God. Size underscore. Mm, Why? Mm, mm, 
This is how you do it inverted question mark inverted exclamation mark inverted question mark underscore. <laughs> underscore. <laughs> the thought of giving away money disturbs Brian. <laughs> I'm so sad about the invert question marks. I mean, the ones that weren't said. Yeah, with a question mark, it stays on top. <laughs> okay, so you need to use a question mark. Got it, got it. Oh my god. Wait, did he use uh, an exclamation? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> this is so stupid. Oh my god, the floof. Yeah. Is it long or short floof? Not that it really matters. Because they both have their horrible qualities. <laughs> long white floof? Oh lord. Yeah, I have floof everywhere at the moment because the cats are shedding like crazy. The best part is when it gets in your face and then you try to get it off your face, but it just doesn't want to. You can feel it. You can feel it with your face, but you can't, like, no matter how much you try, you can't get it off with your hands. It's the worst. And I already have enough hair on my face as it is. Thank you very much. I don't need more. I have to have eaten a lot of fluff, fluff but <laughs> yeah. Uh, me too. I've had fluff since I was born. Same. Dude, my facial hair. If I were to go on tea, I would like instantly create a beard, I'm afraid. Which honestly, I, I would love. But what I have now is just crap. I I just have a constant five o'clock shadow and it's freaking me out. Like I and I also I just can't be bothered. Uh, so I'm just constantly I am constantly plucking my beard, but uh for the, the past couple of like I don't know maybe even two months I have not been bothered taking care of my mustache so it's weird because it's giving me all kinds of emotions because like when you're non-binary gender dysphoria is so weird because sometimes it's gender affirming you look in the mirror and there's a mustache and you're like yeah that's right other times you look in the mirror and you're like, it's not supposed to be there. It's so annoying. Uh, the cat I had when I was born didn't like me. Oh, that's sad. You're enjoying your beard, <laughs> beard-ish, because it's very patchy. Yeah, it'll come. Sometimes it takes a while. Yeah, both my parents are like, oh my god. Like, the, the hairiness is very much in the family on both sides, so uh, yay, fun. It's only on your left side, oh my god. Yours was a bit patchy until your late 20s? Oh, wow. Love. I have no grandparents to show me. Uh, me neither. Wait. I'm thinking. No. I mean, I know my um, my dad's dad, and also my dad. Like my dad is, got bald at when he was like 16. He started to get bald. Uh, my grandpa was bald pretty early. 
The other side of my family, who knows, because they didn't get old. Have <laughs> appeared. Sounds like a new trend, appeared on the left side. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, um... It's like uh, asymmetrical hair, but on your face, you know? Oh, Jesus, that totally sounds like something I would do, you know? Trim it very angular and stylistic. <laughs> yeah, that's a, that sounds so, like something I would do. I would, like, grow out my, um, my, my beard and my stash and then, like, shave half of it off and pretend like it... And just go to the... To the store and pretend like I'm normal. <laughs> <laughs> you're not touching it until you're going back to uni? I mean, touching it's good though. As in... Uh, you're also pretending you're normal? Well, aren't we all? No, like not shaving it. Yeah, I understand. But isn't that like actually good it's what i understand for my uh, trans friends to like touch it i mean as in shave it but i do understand though uh like instead of a tribal face tattoo you do this instead of the beard <laughs> yeah it was kind of what i was picturing like or like i uh, have like a Oh my god, I my brain is making all of the designs right now. This is stupid. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't really do anything when I shave. It's, uh, it's, okay. I mean, obviously, it's... No, it doesn't make more hair. No, no, no. But your the your I mean your hair is very much changing still. Like it's it's not been so long. Yeah, I feel ya. It'll change though. I'm totally doing this as one of the transitions when I go clean cut again. Yes. I'm here for it. Oh, uh, I scream, yes. Why did I just... I'm not gonna ask questions. I don't know why sometimes everything reloads. It lets you notice the newer hair too. Yeah, that is that is true. Yep. That is true. They're on my left side burn. Oh my god. <laughs> I am both excited and dreading the day that you're gonna shave off your beard, love. I know it's going to happen at some point. It's like how I am... It's inevitable that I'm going to cut my hair off again at some point. Or like just entirely shave it off in one go. <laughs> like I'm dreading the day but I'm also kind of excited. Yeah, you have been. I know, I know. But I, I really love your beard. But I also really just love you. I just love you. So, like, it doesn't really matter. I really want to just grow my hair out. Yeah. I love your hair. Stop tempting each other. <laughs> oh my god, I would love that so much. Advice from an idiot. Don't use a face razor on the back of your head blind. Blech. Relax, dude. Yeah. 
Can I tempt you instead, Slip? No, don't touch Slip's hair. Come on now. Ah, oh, Jack, stop. <laughs> shave your head, shave your beard, you know you want to? Dude, relax. I can make it happen tomorrow or live on stream. Dude, okay, listen. Here's the thing. I know at some point in my life I'm going to be tired of shit and I'm just going to want to uh, cut it off or shave it off. And I'm and honestly, if at that point I'm still streaming, <clears throat> I am probably going to do that live on stream, yeah, cuz why the fuck not? Like that's that's uh, fun to do for cloud, right? Free content. <laughs> But for now, I'm not doing it yet. Even though I fucking hate my hair currently. Because it's very hot. It really fucking sucks when it's hot and you have a bunch of hair in your head. Charity stream becoming bald. Oh my god. No, look, when, when I'm... When, I'm not going to shave my head for a challenge ever. If somebody out of the blue offers me an insane amount of money, I would maybe do it. But also, at this, because I kind of need money, you know? I'm just saying. Like, I really need a lot of money. But it would have to be an insane amount. Because, listen. I do what I want. <laughs> and currently, I'm fine with this hair. I, I want to keep it. And even though it doesn't do what I want right now. And, um... It's also not, uh, like, for some reason the color doesn't want to stick. I think Florida actually ruined my hair, but oh well. Six plus digits and I will do it. Six plus digits? Six? Six. the bleach water. Yeah, but it's so weird, dude. It's weird. Because, you know, my hair, it didn't used to be like that. I put, like, I color my hair and then it stays in my hair for the most ridiculous amount of time where everyone's like, whoa, how the fuck is there still color in your hair? And I'm like, I don't know. My hair is just super healthy and I don't wash it uh, like I wash my hair like pretty cold and I don't wash it every day and I don't go into the sun all the time and like you know I'm, I'm, I'm just being healthy and all that kind of stuff so yeah and now it's just trash I've been in Florida for three months I'm like it's just shit so, I don't know. I'm gonna have to live with it. Like, seriously, the part, like, half of my, half of my, um, the part that's colored. So, like, half of my hair, basically, it's not split down the middle, by the way, but, like, you know, let, for the sake of it being easier, I'm just gonna say half. Half my hair is, like, uh, uh, is a, a greenish, and the other half is purple. And the green part is supposed to be, like, almost a teal kind of green. It's a very vibrant color. And most of it, for some reason, is just yellow. It stayed for, like, a week. And then it started fading. Like, ain't nobody got time for that. I'm not gonna, like, constantly... Yeah, kind of like that. Exactly. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna constantly be dyeing my hair. I don't have time or money for that. So, it just kind of just... Uh, and the purple part is like half like pink and there's a part that just kind of looks gray because... You know, that's that's what purple does when your hair is like... It's so stupid. But I have to deal with it. It's fine. <laughs> yeah, this is fine. <laughs> it's fine. But yeah, so... Despite all that, I still don't want to shave my hair off right now. Last time you put in a lot of dye. Yeah, and also we did the thing like where I made you do the 
the foil in a different way, so it's actually better the way you did it now. It's just trash. So, I don't know. To be fair, we did use the old die still, so there may be a difference when we use the new die. Because those were both old, like old, old. And I did buy new die since, so... Baby, you can't help it! You can't, you can't help it. Like, my hair totally went to shit because, like, I went to, uh, I went to my hair person, right? Yeah, I know. I know, I know. But I went to my, I went to my hair person and she was also kind of in shock because she was like, holy shit, your hair's never looked this shit before. And I was like, I know. It's trash. It's like I, I, I've been washing my hair with bleach every day. The whole color also just changed. But it's fine. And we'll see what it's like when, uh, you know, wherever we're gonna live. And if it gets too annoying, I'm just gonna cut it right off. No problem. Okay. Does it keep refreshing for y'all too? I'm really annoyed. Why does it do that? Why? It's so weird. Yeah, right. For me too. I'm not doing anything. I'm just sitting here. One day, I'm just gonna bleach my hair and dye it all light blue. Ooh. Blue is a horrible color, by the way. Papaya, just be prepared. It's a horrible color. You're gonna have to reapply it a billion times. I love blue, but it's the reason I don't have it. Oh god. Viperius underscore FX cheered X. Cheered. Ooh, light blue. Ooh, ooh, oi. <laughs> ooh, ooh, oi. <laughs> I look good in blue, though. And I want to do it in the proper expensive way. Okay. Relax. Just shave it like I always do. Yeah, eventually. I mean, my hair dye, I, I'm not, I'm not trying to be a smart ass, but first of all, I went to school for hair, you know, uh, so I, I definitely know what I'm doing. Uh, my hair dye is, uh, basically pure pigment, which is usually not something you're going to get at, uh, any hair place. So it doesn't damage your hair. Actually, it's good for your hair, because it's pure pigment pigment in basically a hair mask. Um, but yeah, it's blue is a really complicated color. Like, if you want a color that you're never going to get rid of ever, it's red. If you want a color that if you don't like it, it's gone in three seconds, blue. But I, I am excited for that idea. Also, hi, Mem. I acknowledged your comment and then didn't even say hi. Uh, Jack made his hair go blue, but it stayed for like six months as green. Yeah, yeah, right. It turns green. That's also the thing. Either it just goes away and gets kind of grayish crappy or it turns green. Depending on the blue. Okay, I read Christmas and got excited and confused at the same time, but it really did not say Christmas, it said Christine. <sighs> My brain. You'd always go for blue black. Yeah, I, I used to have that too for the longest time. It was a great color. You went to the school of you're an idiot? Ah, I don't think you did. Liar. 
Liar, liar, pants on fire. Blue fades to green so quickly, yeah. I do love green though, so that's a plus. Yeah, blue is pretty. I mean, gr green obviously is my favorite color, but I do love a good blue. Uh, <laughs> oh my god, really? We're calling her Christmas now? <laughs> oh god damn it. <laughs> Here I am trying to find where it said Christmas. Well, we have one right now. <laughs> that looked very nice on you, the blue. Fuck! Um, <laughs> wait a second. It looked very nice when you're the blue black. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it did. Um, <laughs> despite me being really pale, it did, it did look very good on me. I <laughs> I'm dying. I Nish. Oh, the acoustics in the studio. Nice <laughs> reaper. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I have fancy stuff, you know? Wait, what? Your net is not Christmas? Slip cultured X10. I know how to type. Okay? Okay? Damn. Um. What? I'm so confused. What is going on with the with the net with the net and the nets? <laughs> what slip what the hell? Hello? I wanted to say name. Okay. Oh your net Oh wait a second. Wait. Oh right. Okay, yes. You're also Christmas, yes. You got stuck in a net. Mm-hmm. Okay. Your, your fingers went to a net. Uh -huh. Well, I mean, you're on... Nine! Nine, nine, nine! You, well, I mean, you are on the net, right? Oh my god. It's already... It's... it's. Uh... Oh, by the way, Slip, how long are you gonna... You're not Christmas? <laughs> uh, how... Uh, when... Uh, how long? A week. Okay. So you'll be back on... Like, actually, like, an entire, like, literally a week, or, like... 999, what's your emergency? Oh, my God. <sighs> Thursday. Yes, literally, actually. <laughs> okay, sorry, jeez. Sorry I asked. <laughs> it's so exciting, though. But you're saying you're going on a road trip. Okay, I'm asking too many questions. You're saying you're going on a road trip. So y'all go in by car? And, okay, you're driving to Sweden. Okay, but then you're gonna like... Are you gonna like stop places? Or... I mean, obviously, because else you die. But, you know. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Give me a break, okay? I'm tired and I forgot my coffee and everything is horrible. I will help you by making German trains one on time. By making German what? Oh my god, my brain! Wait, there's a crazy Ger German man yelling random things. Can you send help? <sighs> I will help you by making German trains on time. What? Oh, you're going. Uh, oh, yeah, and a ferry, of course. Food, photos, all the photos. Yes, please. We need, we need the photos. I need like pretty things. Maybe uh, s silly things. Just things. Can't see what on mobile. German trains, food, ferries. 
<laughs> Germans? Sweden? <laughs> I'm so annoying. I really don't understand how you put up with this stuff. Okay, yeah, you go lurk. Have fun. <laughs> I need to have a forward system to send stuff to my work, my mom, and your Discord. Oh, jeez. Well, you have uh, 44 minutes to implement it. <laughs> We're into this stuff. You guys are just weird. That's how... Wait, that's how to calm the German peoples? I don't think Slip can be calmed. I am resting now. Oh, wow. <laughs> calm. So calm. Oh, God. Slip court cheered X10. I am calm. <laughs> Basmo normally calms him. Okay, but if that's. Uh, I thought I was weird. <laughs> Printer has an issue. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I have one of my tags is uh, my stream tags is chaotic chill, because we're chilling here, but it's also very chaotic. I don't know about Phasmo. I wouldn't play Ma Phasmo, but that doesn't say anything because I wouldn't play most games. I watch most games, but uh, excuse me. Uh, the only reason I would watch Phasmo is the people. So it very much depends on who's playing it. If y'all are playing it, yeah, definitely I would watch. Checking if a Dutch car is here. Oh my god. <sighs> They're coming to take you away. Ha ha. Hee hee. Ho ho. We need to get the gang back together. Yeah, you should get the gang back together. And then I can just sit on the sidelines and watch y'all. Okay? That's most seems kind of boring. Um. Yes, but when you have the right people, it's fun. I want to know what um, Cosmo means now. I bet it's nothing like Pichu. I was trying to take a sip of water, but that almost went all the way wrong. <laughs> yeah, I'm one of those weirdos. Like, Twitch is the invention for me. Or like any platform that uh, supports streaming. <gasps> or videos of people playing games. Because... I don't play games myself. Uh, I mean, not. I mean, okay. Obviously, I do play games myself, but I'm, I'm very c clumsy when it comes to playing games. So I don't really enjoy it. And also, I get uh, motion sickness and other weird shit when I'm playing games, like really bad ticks. So I can't play most games. Uh, but I'd like to watch it. Oh, wait. I miss- I'm missing. I'm missing. For example, time zone is... Chasove Pasmo? So it means, like, a zone? Oh, okay. That was totally butchered, by the way, but who cares? Anyway. Um, y you can laugh at me. It's fine. It's fine! Um... <laughs> You're lying. 
<laughs> really? Anyway. What was I get? A bit Russian? Oh, that's, that's, I take it. So Italy is the pizza pasmo. <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay, so anyway. Uh, so I always like watching people play games. That was kind of, kind of, just, that has always been my thing. Even when I was a child, um, and I would have the occasional times where I was at somebody's place and they had a computer or a console or something. I, um... Uh, and they would be like, do you want to play? I'd be like, yeah, no, I'll, I'll just, I watch. Watching is nice. And I would just like sit at the sidelines and watch them play a game and I would be content. And um, I also have this with board games, by the way, but to a lesser extent, because I fucking hate board games usually, most of the time. Again, it depends who's playing. Sometimes people are entertaining and it doesn't really matter what they're playing. It's just the people that are hilarious and that's what I watch it for. Watching is nice. Yes. Mm hmm. Sometimes you don't want to play the game, you just want to watch. But, um... <laughs> so I was really happy when uh, people started playing games online and I could watch them play games. I'd be like, oh my god, I don't have any friends, but I can watch people online. <laughs> I'm not sad. Sometimes you are the game and I'm concerned and I have definitely missed many chapters. Yes. And that's okay because sometimes sometimes those chapters aren't important. <laughs> no one likes to get played. Yeah, yeah, don't kink shame. You never know what people are into, you know? <laughs> I disagree. You disagree on what? It's it's not kink shame. I'm joking, I'm joking. I wish I had 500 spoons now. Oh my god. You're just spending those things like crazy. <laughs> fuck, or dude. Fuck, shit, fuck. What even just happened? Like, that was like... That was all of the languages combined, and also, like, my heart just kind of exploded out of my chest because I just didn't. T question. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Okay, T question. Look, I actually saw it this time, dude. Oh my god, relax! Relax! Ah, <sighs> tea question. Tea question. Number six. Do we have number six yet? I don't think so. Yes, we did. Fuckaroo. It's, 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 we have to re-roll again. Come on now. Oh my god, I'm, I'm... <laughs> I knew it. I was like, wait, I know that number. <laughs> Okay, last time, 30. I'm gonna cry. I keep clicking the wrong button, too, for some reason. Um, I can't remember if we've had this one, but I just wanna... I'm gonna do it anyway, because I can only... I'm only gonna re-roll three times, and then it's like... that's okay. I'm, Or, like, twice, actually. <laughs> okay, so the T... Uh, Jack's T question... Jack's T question is the following. Which past hobby would you like to pick up again? And uh, I'm pinning it. So it doesn't go away. There we go. Um, 
fun. I mean, we were just talking about uh, getting a group of people back together, but a past hobby? Wait, are you... Wait, are you bell shaming me? Wow, papaya. Bouldering? Elaborate. When did that happen? How did you get into that? Uh, I want to know all the things. Fencing? Sheep wrangling? Sailing? Excuse me. What? You could barely hear the bell? Oh my god. I'll turn it up then. I'll put it on my list, okay? Turn up bell. I put it on my list. Because I still can, uh, I can increase the sound for this one. Okay, let me, uh, what, in like fourth grade? We had a climbing wall thing at primary school? Cool. That's really cool. I have things I want to do that I never did, like bouldering. <laughs> All my things are random, but like, wait a second. But Jack, did you do all those? That's really cool. I can't even think of many hobbies that I dropped apart from chess, ping pong, badminton. I want to do badminton with you too. Can I do badminton with you? Because I really fucking suck at sports, but badminton I always liked. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> I may suck at it, but that's okay. And table tennis also. Yes, I fucking love table tennis. But nobody ever wants to play with me for some reason. Edmonton's kind of boring. Yeah, but here's the thing, right? Um, because of the way my eyes don't work together very much, uh, Edmonton works better than a lot of other things because it... I'm not saying it's slow, but I can... It's just slow. The thing is just slow enough that I can follow it. Also, it's the shape of the... the what the fuck is the thing called? Help. I can follow it better for some reason. No, not the fucking racket. Yes. The birdie. I don't even... I'm trying to... F I'm struggling to figure out what it's called in Dutch. Yeah. We call it, um... Shuttle, I think? Which is really weird. Featherball makes total sense. But, uh, uh, Viperius just said birdie, so probably, yeah. A <laughs> badminton ball. <laughs> oh, I'm missing everything, by the way, fuck. Uh, but yeah, uh, so, th because of the way my eyes work, it's, it's, like, complicated. And I've, I've learned to deal with it now, but when I was younger, I, I had real trouble, like, uh, with, like, distance, and, um, all that kind of stuff. I've kind of learned how to correct that, so it's getting... Shuttlecock? Really? I am seeing something completely different when you say shuttlecock. It seems to be feather ball, which is also the sport of just shooting it back and forth. Okay, but like, yeah, but I know the... I've heard that. Shuttlecock. That's not okay. That's just not okay, dude. What is a badminton ball called? Historically, the shuttlecock. See, I'm telling you, in, in 
when I was young, when I was young, uh, back in my day, we used to call it shuttle. And I don't know if that's actually an origi- uh, an, uh, 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 a thing that, that like you're supposed to... I don't have words anymore. God damn it. Also known as a bird or birdie with a small cork hemisphere with 16 goose feathers attached and weighing... Okay, well... Because it has feathers. My cock because it has feathers. And everyone wants to hit it? Wow. <laughs> Holy shit, Slip. Back to Swaffelin. Yep. Okay, so actually we're all gonna play badminton, but we're calling it Swaffelin now. Yep. That's settled. I feel like I missed a bunch of shit and now I have to go back. Uh, but Jack, fencing. Sheep wrangling? Sailing? I, I need to know stuff. Like, are those all things you tried because you got interested? Or are those things you like, ro like, did you just like roll into it somehow? Did you have friends that did, like, how did help? They're all weird and I love it. Also, I would love to learn how to play chess, but I'm afraid that my brain just not is gonna is, is not gonna let me. Sheep wrangling. In short, I had to put a very horny male sheep in a crayon outfit. <sighs> Fencing. I quit dance, so was made to choose another thing. Okay. Wait, you're leaving. Ah, I'm dying. Uh, uh <laughs> what's LFG's shuttlecock? Hit, hit each other with your long thingy. <laughs> okay, well, if you're actually leaving, slip. I to have a Dewey. Uh, bye, Dewey. Have fun. Send all the pictures. If you're awesome, I love you. I'm gonna miss you. This is great. Uh, bye. <laughs> Have we? Yeah. Also, there's ads starting, and I forgot to mention. Um, you quit dancing, so you were ready to choose another thing. Okay, that makes sense, I guess. My brain is too lazy for chess. My brain is too um. Uh, different for chess but I would like to try and no one ever act like has been actively trying to teach me it because they probably figured your brain's not made for this I'm not gonna I'm, I'm not gonna bother sailing my mother's friend's kid got into your mother's friend's kid got into sailing when he was on holiday and my mother got fed up with me and put me on a course. Oh. So like... Okay, but you did end up liking it though. Now you can sail places and not die. Just need to get a boat. That's nice. Well, that's a good... Um, that's... <sighs> yeah. Oh, I do many more courses. Oh my god. I am... Um... Oh, I didn't even answer the question, by the way. I didn't even answer the question. I just had y'all answer the question. I don't know. Is that an answer, too? <laughs> oh, Captain, my Captain. Friends explained their rules to me when we were in a, pub, in a pub one time. There's a pub with chess boards as tables. Ooh, that's cool. I was kind of good after a couple of beers. <laughs> nice. Oh, I do love stuff like that. I love um, pubs and stuff with um, themes like that. 
or like weird just weird random shit once uh, Mem and I were in a place they had clocks just clocks everywhere all kinds of different sorts of clocks I love shit like that can you play sober oh my god um I'm still trying to think by the way I'm sorry. Oh, yeah, I would like to um, paint again. Not so much art, I think. More furniture. I would like to make furniture. Which is not something I can do by myself. So, you know. But then once, like, I like to um, revamp furniture. Like, old shit, especially ugly shit, and then make it look more fun. So I do very much enjoy painting furniture. So just like, uh, you know, find furniture on the side of the road. Wooded furniture, obviously. Find it, um... Oh my god. Find it on the side of the road, or someone's advertising it for, like, a, the tiniest amount of money, or for free, or something. And, uh, and just make it better. You know, when you have, like, boring shit, and you turn it into something with bright colors and stuff like that. I like doing that. Find furniture on the side of the road with IKEA. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh. Yep. Not sponsored. Hashtag not sponsored. I wish. God damn. Like that would actually be the best sponsor. That or any hardware store. Like actually. Oh, I love IKEA. I love IKEA and I love going to uh, to uh, to hardware stores. I meant more like be nice to a planet and give furniture new life, but yours could too. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> yep. Um, <laughs> I do like thrift shopping too, by the way. Sometimes you see stuff and, well, I see stuff, okay? I can't say you because I don't know you. Uh, but sometimes I see stuff. <laughs> Yo, Alistair, how's it going? Sometimes I see stuff and it's ugly as fuck, but I can see the potential and I get really excited and then and then because it's ugly as fuck um, and, and, and also sometimes just half falling apart, it doesn't cost shit, you know, so you can like, you can just get, uh, you can get like basically a good uh, closet or, uh, or chair or like table or whatever for next to nothing and then i love that shit like i love then like fixing it up and making sure that it doesn't fall apart and that it's clean and then i can like go to town on it and just uh you know make it into a completely different thing i absolutely love that and i do miss doing that so i would like to uh eventually get to that point again how are you doing Alistair god I I don't know why but like my um I I'm reasonable I'm all over the place as usual but um 
Yeah, this morning I was, uh, or, or earlier in the day, I should say, I, I was super hyper and everything. And then I just kind of crashed. And, um, and I got really sad for no reason. <laughs> and now, okay, I'm just tired. And for some reason, my stomach is not agreeing with what I ate. And it doesn't make any sense because I didn't eat anything weird. Uh, but for some reason my stomach's like, nah, I don't like it. So that's kind of a deal, but yeah. My favorite piece of clothes is a flannel my mom bought with my dad when they started dating. They both bought the, sa bought the same one. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. And yes, I do love to do stuff with like with clothes too, except I suck at it. So I will have design ideas and stuff like that, but I can't actually do it myself. I'll have to try to explain my my weird ideas to other people so they can do it. Uh, with furniture, I can just you know it, it's easier also i do love to do it with uh i do love to like do weird shit with like just walls inside of the house or uh like anything that can be painted really i just love painting you gave up on fashioning play the sheep what miniature painting i would love to do that we were talking about that the other day. Cause, uh... <clears throat> Cause Viperius... Yes, exactly. Viperius posted a, a thing in, in the Discord. Uh, an article of someone who paints their Warhammer 40k... Uh... Uh... God... Fucking... Fake miniatures. <laughs> <laughs> help uh, in uh, pride colors and it looks so good but yeah I've always wanted to 40k is a job not a hobby yeah I get that my um uncle used to make he used to to put um, miniatures together but like miniature cars and motorcycles and I think planes and he would also paint them and I was always jealous because my um, my fine motor skills were absolute crap so I really couldn't do stuff like that it took me like 25 years at least to get my fine motor skills under control <laughs> yep apparently that's a normal thing when you have ADHD and also again the, the thing with my eyes probably didn't help <laughs> they are like, which firstborn do you want to sell first? <laughs> oh my god. Take him. <laughs> Take them all. <laughs> oh my god. You don't have the brain for it anymore? Yeah, maybe. I've never considered you the painter, though. Or is that just like bigger objects that that you're not? Or am I just dissing you right now? Sorry, I was talking to Havoc. You're a blacksmith? Nice. Never got into painting, but I can make a knife. Ooh, that's exciting. I like that. I assume he's talking about the rules? Wait, what? Oh, right. Rules, yes. But also the painting, because I, I know a thing or two. We've painted this entire house together, and uh, I am the one that does the, like, uh, detail stuff and makes sure that lines are straight and, like, and I don't use tape for that ever. I just I just do it because I have a steady hand these days. 
It just took me forever. I can totally see the pillow flying into your room. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> Bring it on. I do only abstract. Yeah, but I was talking about details because if you... If you paint miniatures... And you want to like stay in the inside the lines that's kind of my um concern again i'm not trying to dish you because normally i do that all the time you know i'm 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 i like dissing you it's it's one of my favorite things to do but in this case it's just it's just interest have you actually painted miniatures and how did that go there are ways to fake it you don't have to paint in the lines no but yeah but then there's people like me who are just like Diddy can't color inside the lines confirmed? Oh, get fucked. <laughs> Lots of dry brushing and inking. Yeah. It's intricate though, still. Because it's tiny. <laughs> you had... Not only 40k, but also... Yeah. I didn't know that? Oh my god. I didn't know that, but I, I didn't... Uh, I'm... Uh, I'm... Oh my god. I'm... 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 I'm getting distracted again. I'm getting distracted again. I'm distracted because I'm seeing the... Stuff in the Discord. Oh, Papaya sent a link. That's nice. Thank you for the link. I will look at that later. Oh, and Viperius was generous enough to look up the thing he posted and link it as well. Oh, y'all are being so nice today. I'm guessing you like to play dwarves you're such a dick <laughs> <laughs> oh and writing i would love to get back to that yeah me too papaya me too <laughs> who's being nice people are being nice in the well, i don't know like people are just kind of being nice today or maybe i'm just not um, i'm just used to being trolled all the time but no seriously uh I don't know what people are talking about and they send me links and I mention stuff and they actually like, you know, are nice enough to actually link it in the Discord so other people can see what we're talking about. That's, that's, that's nice. <sighs> Make up your mind? Wait, what? Diddy says I'm being nice then calls me a dick. <laughs> But yeah, Papaya, I would like to also get back to writing. I My writer's block happened <laughs> a very long time ago and I, I really miss being able to write. It's also really shitty when a uh, part of your work, like a very, very, very important part of your work is writing and you, you're just, oh, the struggle, oh my god. When you get fed up with Minecraft, you can stream painting a miniature. Okay, yeah, that's a that's a good one. I, you know what? I think that when he gets fed up with Minecraft, he is gonna get fed up with Minecraft because he learns how to play Stardew Valley. He'll love that even more. You don't have a writer's block, just too many ideas. It's kind of a blockage, isn't it? Oh my god. Oh, you're distracting me too, Jack. The password game? What the hell? 
Oh my god. Bunch of nerds. Solo Stardew or group- Oh, yeah, right. Uh, Papaya, um, Viperius enjoys Stardew. Just so you know. Don't stare, it's facts. <laughs> I mean, I just... Fun for the first hundred hours. There's people who play it for life. I don't understand it at all. Stardew is one of those games that I only watch people play because there are certain people that I would watch anything play because I just like the person. Current playtime, 324 and a half hours. Baby. <laughs> You're rich and you can make so much wine and date everyone? Okay, the rich part is nice. I don't care about wine and dating everyone. I can totally do that in real life. I've been doing nothing but. <laughs> That's how much time I have in Satisfactory. Oh, Satisfactory. That does sound like a game for you, Big Mama. Oh wait, I'm now seeing that even Havoc said there's always Stardew Valley. Oh my god. Writing a restraining order? Wait, what? <laughs> I, <laughs> I, I think she said nice dick. I mean, yes, but that's not what I said. Uh, but <sighs> Oh my god, I'm so confused. There's so much going on. Why? Why? You said you like writing? <laughs> yes. Oh my god. <sighs> oh my god, you guys. What the hell? Like, seriously. Can we ban Alistair? <laughs> I mean, yeah, we sure can. <laughs> wow, you come in here and immediately cause a ruckus? Among Stardew Valley people? <laughs> you want it too bad. So, did you say it can be a mod? Oh my god. I have to figure out how to do the thing. Like, I kind of want to do the thing. I've seen it elsewhere. Where people just use like the command mod off and mod on. And they change from VIP to mod and from mod to VIP. Uh, which obviously is reserved for only certain people who are actually, you know, allowed to be mod. That would be a really cool thing and then you could eat his ass. <laughs> Make me a mod? I gotta clean up some old fruit off the floor? Wow, Alistair! Holy shit! <laughs> no, but it's like in, in, that, in that case, it's like, it's not even in a trolley way. It, I, it can be in a trolley way, but like people literally are just like, okay, so today I'm not modding because I have life to do, and then they just turn the their mod off. Streamer bot, as far as you know, okay. Because I have to look into that, just for funsies. Whose side are you on? Holy moly, are we just having a fight here? <laughs> <laughs> Mod fight! Mod fight! Mod fight! <laughs> oh my god. Havoc doesn't choose sides. Also, Havoc doesn't ban people. So boring. Think about what you're gonna say, Havoc. <laughs> oh 
my god. You can't claim havoc. What? It, what's this anarchy? Hello? We were literally talking about a game I don't even know anything about and y'all are just like starting a war over it. Ugh. Look at these petty humans. Starting a war over Stardew Valley. A game that I thought only girls played. You know, cutesy girls. You know, girls girls. Havoc has been claimed, right? <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Already been claimed. Move along. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay, this is the best. <laughs> I would almost forget that my stomach's acting up. <laughs> it really feels like shit and I don't understand why. What did I do? I just I just ate like normal. Havoc ain't you gonna tell him? Oh my god, Alistair, you're so losing this one. And I'm not doing anything about it. I'm just enjoying myself. See, I'm just sitting here. People are all like, oh yeah, being a streamer is hard work. No, I just watch my chat go insane. That's what I do here. Yeah, he does have wall power. <laughs> I think we scared him off. <sighs> no, Havoc is very busy today. Not just today, but uh... He has things to do. People to meet. I said it the right way this time. <laughs> Resting the brain likely? Yes, because he's had a really fucking busy day. Holy shit. Oh my god. <sighs> Poor dude. I'm here for triage. Oh god. Who's being serenaded? Being serenaded by banjos and basses. Banjos and basses. Do we already have a band called banjos and basses? Oh, hi, Jack. <laughs> Is it because you're in Florida? What, the banjos and basses? Are we admitting stuff like this now? Oh my god, dude. He can't help where he was born? <laughs> God damn, you guys. Oh, fuck. Why does it get me every time? I don't understand. <laughs> this is so stupid. <laughs> it's like when I'm... Oh, but I'm, I'm so easily jump scared though. It's like when I'm standing next to the toaster and I'm literally waiting for my bread to be toasted. I do this every single day, by the way. I toast my bread every single day. I'm standing next to the toaster and every time it goes off, I get a heart attack. <laughs> Why is that? I know it's happening. Also, my toaster is evil. Because sometimes it just decides to eat my bread. It can be polite and just pop it up like normal, and then sometimes it just wants to eat it. 
The brave little evil toaster? Oh, wow. I don't know about brave with this one, but definitely a bit evil. <sighs> yeah, again, that's one of those things I know. I know. But I can't remember it. I remember talking about it with someone. Never seen the evil ones. Just the regular ones. Come into my kitchen. You'll see the evil one. <laughs> I'm old? Oh, well. I was gonna say we all are here, but no, that's, that's not true, actually. Not all of us are. I know about the toaster. I know I've talked about it with someone, but no, no, you're not old. You're just starting. Papaya isn't either. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I mean... Yeah, I, I don't I don't really believe in the concept of old though, I just call myself old for fun. Let's start a cult. <gasps> a cult of youth? Wow. You're a minority around these uh uh I just, look, I the the later it gets, the more words I lose. I'm still older than you, and no, I don't like cults. You don't? Are you sure? I like cults. Oh. <laughs> no, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. We're gonna have the last round of ads. I'm saying the last round of ads because I'm definitely ending within the next half hour. All these kiddos trying to join cults. <laughs> yes, sure, sure. <laughs> I am going to be ending in the in the in the next half hour. Are you? Are, oh my god! Wait, what? What kind of cult are you starting, Alistair? The cult of Alistair. I mean, it sounds good, but what are you doing? Why should I join? What are we going to do? What are we going to get out of it? Going to join in to find out? Oh, hell no. Need to find a bunch more people named Alistair. <laughs> Let's just say we got the best Kool-Aid. The best. Okay. I don't care. Gotta come up with something better than that. I know at least one, yeah. I was just gonna say. <laughs> oh, frickety frack. Viperius underscore FX cheer deck Oh my god. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Would you like to join a cult underscore? Beep, 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 beep. <laughs> That's what you get for it. <laughs> That's what you get for it on stuff. <laughs> oh, papaya, you're the best. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> oh my god. <laughs> yep, that is totally what you get for Aiden on Stardew. Mm -hmm. Yep, yep. Anyone know how to chess or read? I know how to read. Uh, oh! Oh my god, I can't stop yawning. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, I know how to read, uh, but I also don't. Oh my god. There's another one hating on Stardew, Papaya. Wanna join a cult? Is it gonna be the anti-Stardew cult, Alistair? Uh... I forgot what I was saying! Reading! Oh, poor Papaya. Yeah. Stardew Death Valley- God damn it! Okay. Um, right. Reading. I would love to read. I used to read all the time. When I was a kid, I would read an entire book every single day, and I don't mean like tiny ones. I can't do it anymore. Sounds like Dee Dee needs a fan. Wait. What? What will happen to our life at the farm now? We had a plan? Oh, Jesus Christ. Live at the farm? Live at the farm? If you don't want to live at the farm, you don't have to. Only fans? I don't want an only fans, you guys. I can buy my own sheep. Wait, are we still talking about Stardew? Or only farts? Yes! The problem is, right, when it's only farts, it's like the people that 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 like farts in a whole different kind of way. <laughs> That's not me. I like them because they're hilarious. <laughs> hey, no kink shaming. There's no kink shaming here. But I just think they're hilarious. I can't help it. Streamer fart in a bottle, $500. Dude, relax. They're like, can you send me so like I can't do that. Like I listen, I again I need money. I very much need money for like actual legit uh adulting reasons. But I would never. I c I would not be able to. Like how can you, how? I just no, how? I'll shame every kink all the same. <sighs> okay, maybe I should make an exception for you. Maybe I should sell streamer water? Okay, that just sounds like you're selling pee. <laughs> what the fuck? It is whatever it is. Someone would enjoy that. Yeah, I know. I know. I know. But no, just, just no. Also, at the same time, I'm scrolling up to see, like, what I've missed, because I always miss everything, and I'm seeing Jack say, Internet calls don't kill people anymore. What? Uh, Are you young enough, Alistair? Wow, Jack! Toxic! <laughs> You're... You're really, uh, you're really, um, turning, Jack. I like it. Only IRL cults kill people nowadays. <laughs> it should not be that hard to start a conspiracy that it has healing powers. You live in Florida, after all. Oh my god. Florida man sells pee water for pee water. For, oh, well, I mean, yeah, definitely. For a hundred dollars per milliliter. <laughs> I'm sorry, Florida man. <laughs> Florida man sells miraculous healing potion. Says it's made out of his pee. 
Way to steal my thunder. I mean, I was just first, okay? For injection? Oh, God. Florida man sells pee water. Pretty sure that was an actual thing at one point or another. I mean, Florida man does everything, right? I feel like that would be Florida man and... <laughs> you two really found each other? <laughs> yep. Yep, yep. <laughs> Sorry. One way to pass a drug test? I mean, you really don't want Florida man pee for that, Alistair, because most of Florida man's pee is definitely not good to pass a drug test, I'm afraid. <laughs> I love you too. Oh my god. Uh Okay. Okay. I've, I've caught up. <sighs> oh my god. Oh my god. I was I ah. No queasy 23 raided my stream with 8 viewers. No queasy. <laughs> Hi Noxy. Thank you for the raid! And welcome in, Garster and Guitar and Noxie, of course. <laughs> oh my god. Um, yeah, let's pretend everything's normal here. <laughs> we saw you were alive and couldn't not. Well, I'm flattered, thank you! <laughs> uh, what, were you what were you up to? What were you doing? Because I got really excited when I saw your announcement that you were going to stream. Thank you for the shout out. Thank you, thank you. Please uh, follow Noxie because she's really cool. And she does stuff like Minecraft and things. And uh, the last things I've seen her do was play Minecraft where she was like making a bunch of really cool things happen with armor stands. And... It's really chill and the community is amazing. But yeah, I saw your um no your um oh, dang it, your thing that you were gonna go live and I was like, oh yeah, I'm excited and then I remembered that I was gonna stream, so I couldn't be there. That's really crappy. Why would we pretend to be normal? I mean, we were talking about really weird shit and I promise I had nothing to do with it. Uh, am I missing stuff again? Just, oh my god. Jack, don't tell on us. <laughs> Fighting totally normally sized phantoms? Oh, Jesus Christ. Is there one of those, um... Data packs or something that makes... Uh, phantoms bigger the longer you don't sleep? Making a sniffer enclosure. Oh yeah, that's what you were gonna do. Awesome. Oh, sniffers are so cool. I kind of wanna... I, um... I kind of wanna have the... The mod or whatever it is that lets you name tag baby animals and then they stay babies because baby animals in minecraft are cute but like baby sniffers <laughs> they're adorable <laughs> Yes, Turltus. Baby Turltus. Mm hmm. Yes. Sounds like a crime. I mean, when I was a child, I, uh, you know, an actual one, not the child that I am now. 
uh, I would pretend that, uh, I mean, it was totally true. That I had found, uh, uh, a way to, like, I, I found a, a genetic thing, um, that would make, that would keep baby, that, that would keep kittens, kittens, so they would never, like, they would obviously grow old, but they would never grow up. And, uh, yeah, that went really far. <laughs> like, I would, I would bring my, my actual kittens, who were obviously, uh, you know, just plushies. But no, they were totally real. Um, <laughs> I would bring them to school and, like, I, I would, I would nerd out about it, like, a lot. Because, you know, and that's one of the reasons that people didn't like me. <laughs> But it's cute because um, one of the teachers I had uh, in that, like, during that time, because this lasted for years, by the way. Um, one of the teachers I had, um, I sometimes run into him still. <laughs> and um, I kid you not, like, I am almost 39. Every time I run into him, like, it happens about once a year or something. I will run into him and uh, in passing, he will go, How are the kittens doing? <laughs> Thank you for the follow. <laughs> you were talking about time travel all the time? Oh my god. Oh jeez. Wait, he's sniffing babies? Wait, what? Oh god. No, no, a baby sniffer, not a baby sniffer. <laughs> this place is fun. I don't know about that. Still can't hear- can Oh yeah, that's what I was gonna ask. Papaya, did you ever um, go into Minecraft and actually uh, do the, the, the cat taming thing to see if you could hear it inside of Minecraft? to breathe and it just went all wrong uh, I killed a couple of cats but forgot to tame new ones wow what the fuck papaya holy shit <laughs> you're so cruel <laughs> what the hell you guys wow <laughs> wow Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> like, forgot to tame some new ones. Why did you kill them in the first place? They are annoying. They spawn in my trading hall. I mean... Wow. Do you at least have the heads pack installed so you get heads sometimes? Heads. You get heads. I didn't say you get head. Okay? You didn't hear me say that. Okay, ma'am. Doei. Everybody say do it to Mem. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out, Mem. And good night. <laughs> you have a lot of cat heads? Okay, well that makes it even creepier actually, but you know. We're just gonna pretend it's fine. Right? It's fine. It's fine. There's nothing to see here. It's fine. You are cruel, they say to the vegan one in the chat. Yes! That's the whole thing! Like, wow. You know what's a challenge? Vegan Minecraft. At the start, especially. I mean, because, you know, uh, the. Fr Thanks, Var! It's just pixels. Oh my god. <laughs> Relax. <laughs> Hi, Var. Thank you for the follow. Vegan Subnautica is fun. 
Is that even possible? Oh, yeah, it is. Because you get plants, but it's it's hard at the start though, right? Yeah, but it's a good challenge. <sighs> uh Okay. Thanks for hanging out and um just messing up the chat even more, Alistair. <laughs> and yes, follow Alistair. Or not, you know, whatever the fuck you want, but like you're kind of missing out, so I, I suggest you highly suggest you do it anyway. Uh Minecraft? Good music? Chill times? Some annoying people, like here, basically? <laughs> Why did it say Noxie again? What? What are you talking about? What are you talking about? It doesn't. doesn't. I promise. You may need to uh, private discord? Oh, did you take a screenshot? What the heck? Oh, that's interesting. It did actually, guys, but it, but it also didn't. So don't worry about it. I don't know, things are just broken lately. Uh, but yeah, uh, so anyway, uh, vegan uh, games is a challenge. Because <clears throat> like, the later you get in the game, at least for Minecraft, Right? I can speak for Minecraft. The later you get in the game, the easier it gets to just live off of, uh, you know, farmers and stuff. And like, or your own farms. But when you're just starting, it's really hard to um, <clears throat> sustain with uh, just plants. Stops worrying. Just stops worrying because that's totally a thing that can happen. You know what? <sighs> I'm never gonna call you nice anymore. It's 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 over. Just gonna find a village and live in it for a while? Yes. But what if you just have bad luck and you you can't? Because I was the luckiest person. In both my worlds, uh, the first one I started on not my own account because I wanted to know if I could actually play Minecraft uh, at, even slightly, like without like dying, basically, because it, playing games is really hard for me. So uh, I tried it on Havoc's account and uh, just to see if I could actually teach myself the controls and also not get sick all over the place and stuff like that. And, uh, uh, so I started a new world and I spawned right next to a village. A pretty good one, too. Um, so that's nice. And, uh, my current world... Oh, my current world, I kind of cheated. Because, uh... Because Havoc had started a world? And a random seed, by the way. And it was such a lucky seed. For beginners, that is. So I just used that one. And it's also, it's also like, spawn is right next to a, vill a village. So, you know, that was easy. But wh why did chat just pop off? What's going on? It's not really a challenge. You can eat potatoes, melons, golden carrots. But you can't use books, item frames, paintings. Yeah. That's true. That's true. If it's just about the eating part, it's kind of fine, unless you're very unlucky. It's still hard at the start, though. Because it takes a while before you have all of the... 
like before you have the 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 fruits and vegetables and stuff to live off of and bread it can totally take a while and if you're uh clumsy or very unlucky you can lose health real fast uh wait who's evil now wait what Oh, and you can't use a bed. Oh, because of wool. Oh my god. You can't shear? Vegan means you're not using any... Uh, any e uh, animal products. So, yeah, no, you can't shear. Or use what has already been made. No. Anything that comes from animals isn't vegan. Yeah. They have to be sheared or it gets dangerous. Yeah, but it's not real life. It's Minecraft, though. Also, not really. That's like cheating. <laughs> Some people take it to the extent that you can't kill monsters, so you can't beat the game. I mean, I can't beat the game on uh, peaceful. Technically, right? Technically, it could be possible. Uh... Because there's a one in ridiculous chance of finding um, what's it called? Oh my god, finding an end portal that is entirely filled. But you would have to locate the end portal yourself because you can't make uh, Eyes of Ender. Right, yeah, but I was talking about peaceful. P peaceful. Yes, you can't kill the dragon when it's vegan uh, version. Good God, I was just talking about food. What if my cat gives me enough string to make it? Who knows where they got it from? Probably my other clothes. Yeah. Because cobwebs are made by spiders, so not vegan, apparently. <sighs> I wouldn't count the cobwebs. Oh my god, do people count the cobwebs, Papaya? I know you don't. But do- Really? They do? Ooh, that's horrid. But yeah, cats can actually bring you enough string. Because cats have brought me a lot of things. It's how I played, uh, it's how I got a lot of things in, in Peaceful. I got string and I got um, phantom membranes and stuff like that. From my cats. Oh my god. Remember how I said I was going to end? Every time I think it's getting chill, y'all pick up again and like do weird shit. There is no end. Technically, you should not use that. Yeah, it's about the should. It's the should. It's like, you're finding it, but you shouldn't use it. Never allowed to end? Oh my god. I have to, though. So if it could be non-vegan, you have to assume it's non-vegan. What? Oh, right. Yes, yes. Yeah, that's how it works, yeah. Might I suggest that you go find out about the Timothy... I want to know how to say Shalomet. And, and yes, I will probably eventually find out about it, yeah. Are we making string out of... We're not making string out of Timothy. Oh my god, you guys. Because it has 
animal product. Okay, relax. Maybe once he dies? No, that's not how veganism works. You're still learning? Oh my god, the freaking clueless. I don't think I heard the reaction to finding string in chests. I didn't see your thing about string and chests, so thank you for reposting. Uh, but yeah, if it's if it's uh, no, because even if you find leather in chests or string in chests or whatever else, it's an animal product, so you're not supposed to use it. Yeah, you have to assume string is non-vegan. I can farm string with mods? Okay, but we're still assuming that string is made by spiders, which makes it non-vegan. There are vegan mods. Flax. Yes, when it's flax, then it's cool. Because it's a plant. So I will play. I will play if I can use that mod and sleep. Yes. If it's made from flax. But not if it's in vanilla, because in vanilla it's always made by spiders. Or at least that is what the assumption is. <laughs> this is a ridiculous discussion, but also kind of interesting. <clears throat> Switches out the flex string with spider string. No one will ever know. Wow. Toxic. Cheater. Okay, fuck it. I snoozed the... I snoozed the ads. It was almost gonna play ads. And I was like, no, I can't do it. I told y'all that I would stop. <laughs> I told y'all I would stop. I'm gonna do it. Dude, veganism doesn't have cheat days. It's not a diet. <laughs> it's a lifestyle. <laughs> Some treat it like that, though. Oh, my God. <sighs> okay. Listen, listen. It's important. Okay? We're actually raiding this time. We're raiding this time. <laughs> so in superior vegan voice. Oh my god. <laughs> yes, we're raiding. Yeah. Wait, you still here? I'm watching YouTube with a Dutch person. Don't watch YouTube with a Dutch person. Watch Twitch where a Dutch person is streaming. It's very important to make string out of Timothy. Okay, listen! <laughs> oh my god! The the fucking mayhem in here. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna switch uh, scenes and see what happens. Please don't have weird things playing anymore. No, it's not happening. Cool, cool. We're cool, we're cool. Listen! We're raiding today. Blowjobs are vegan! Holy shit, we're talking about blowjobs now? Excuse me? Is there a meme about grachtenpanden in Dutch? I, I don't know, dude. <sighs> Why is everyone just, like, everyone's just ignoring me? No, we're not going back to the chatting screen. We're raiding someone who is having their birthday stream. So I would very much like it if y'all would actually come with me and like rate them. Because birthday streams are fun. All streams are fun. Um so we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna do that. And I'm so lost right now. Um uh, and also Yes. I actually have a no baby God damn! <laughs> Actually, we have uh, an actual rape message. Like, I made an actual rape message with my emotes. So if you're subbed, uh, use the second rape message. 
so you can uh, use my emotes or you don't you know but then I don't like you anymore um, if you're not subbed you can use the first one and you can replace the raid emotes with anything you like the like uh, the generic raid emotes you can replace it with anything you like if you want to or just keep them that way uh, yes yeah, so much says mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> We're going to raid Sin City Live. Um, she's having her birthday stream today, and uh, that's not the only reason to raid her. She's really, co she's a really cool person. Um, she has uh, really nice vibes, and uh, <laughs> you know Minecraft. And I'm really good at promoting people. I promise. Uh, thanks for the stream. It was interesting. <laughs> Yeah, I agree. I agree. It was definitely um, interesting. I'm trying to do everything at the same time. I'm good at this, I promise. Okay, I'm actually starting the raid. Did I do it? I'm doing it. Um, if you don't see... No, I think y'all see the raid bar. I was gonna say, if you don't see the raid bar, refresh so you get counted. But I think everyone's being counted in. Uh, lots of indirect discussions have come? Holy Christ! Okay, listen. Uh, Sin is not exactly family friendly, but she does appreciate it if you, like... You know, innuendos are fine most of the time, but also chill a little and no fucks and shits and asses, like here. Um... <laughs> so, uh, yeah, anyway. Ah, the ads were almost coming again. I had to snooze them again. I love you all and thank you so much for hanging out and I'm a mess. <laughs> and I'll see you soon. And um, uh, uh, have fun at Sin and uh, doi. <laughs>